Hey guys, it's Smarbs here and I have nothing to do except, I don't know, vlog. So, for the first time in forever, I'm actually filming in this angle right here. Because usually, uh, I record stuff in the morning or afternoon. And it would be pretty sunny. I mean, this window, then, like, it would be against the light, then I would be, like, a shadow or something. I would be all black and all. So right now I'm, I'm recording at night because I literally don't have anything to vlog today and I was too lazy to make another voice vlog so I'm gonna make a video vlog and a very quick one because I don't know I'm too lazy to edit again actually it took me forever to edit on that voice vlog I'm just editing on this tablet and I don't know the audio thing, the voiceover, it was having problems. Like it would play too early, even if it's not yet the part where it's supposed to play or something. And well, I don't, I don't know. I have nothing to talk about. Maybe I could do another counting video, but I don't know. Maybe part three from one thousand to one thousand five hundred. Or nah, I don't. Know. I really have nothing to do. Paul was supposed to go here a while ago, but suddenly his mom said he's not allowed. First his mom said he was allowed, but then his mom said he wasn't allowed somehow. I don't know. And well, our plan was if he was to go here and have a sleepover, we can either sleep over here with Inigo or sleep with Inigo in his house. I don't know. We could have a sleepover there at their house, since it's just like on the other side of this road where I'm pointing or actually somewhere here, I don't know Dog Road Yeah, Dog Road is the Dog Road is what we call the road going to Nika's house because there's lots of dogs there and all those dogs are scary There's four main ones Yeah You've seen You've probably seen them all in in Dog Road the summer vlog Dog Road or maybe not because I didn't I didn't get to record dog number one, which was in a yellow house on the left side, right before dog number two, which is the red house. Yeah. Actually, in the red house, there's lots of dogs, but there's only one main guy who was always outside before, and always scaring me before. Like, he always uh, barks at me. If he barks at me, I go back home. If he doesn't, I'll just go straight and eventually he'll follow me and tail me until I'm out of his territory or something. I don't know. Yeah, but now he's always inside. And now he has more friends. So if they were all outside, I don't know, it would be dog hell or something. So, yeah. Another thing is I was playing Call of Duty Ghosts and I finished it the other night. Then I'm also playing Resident Evil Revelations. I can't finish it. I was playing a while ago, I can't finish it. The final boss was hard for me to beat. And I had weak guns. Like his weak point is his heart somewhere here. A huge heart. Like not the shape heart, the organ heart or something. There's a huge heart. Or there's a huge brain on his back. If it's not a brain, it's something that looks like a brain. It's color yellow. When he's about to die, it turns red or something. Basically, whenever he opens his head or something, I mean his head is already open and there's an eyeball right here. Then when it shines so bright, he'll teleport. And when he teleports, he's gonna attack you like that, he's about to smash you. Then his heart will open, so you shoot it and make him, I don't know, like, like, oh, like, like make him get stunned so that his attack will cancel. If you do that a few times, his next step is he'll get angry. He'll teleport, but this time there's two of them. There's two of them in front of you. One is fake, one is real. The real one will breathe violet smoke or something, I don't know. And then there's another one where here's a fake one in front of you. Then you have to turn around and there's the real guy aiming the attack with his heart open. So after all that, he gets very angry, runs at you, maybe, maybe not. That's one of his attacks, he runs after you. Then you have to dodge it. I don't know how to dodge in that game. It says L then forward, which is like left, like left 
thing been forward, but it's actually not working. I don't know why. So the only way to beat him is to use a machine gun or a machine gun, a very strong shotgun, or a magnum. Turns out I have a magnum, but it only has six bullets. Six bullets, as in six bullets. No, I don't have stock when I saved. I mean, I didn't save. It's auto saved. And then my machine gun is. I don't know what my machine gun was. It's fine, but it takes a while. It takes a lot of bullets. Not a lot. Maybe maybe around five bullets for him to get. Maybe not five. Maybe ten. I don't know. Because. I don't know, maybe around 7. Then my shotgun, that's that's a bit strong. It actually takes a while for the firing speed. Like, when you shoot once, it will take a few seconds, or maybe one second, or I don't know, one and a half, one and a quarter, I don't know. But it's definitely slow, so I need to hit him twice with that shotgun, because that shotgun is strong, but it needs to be twice as strong to make him get stunned, to stun him. So I need to hit him twice, but then, by the first shot, I'll be cocking the gun again, but he'll be able to hit me, and yeah, I don't know how to dodge. And there's only five, there's only two available green herbs, which are, like, potions, in the room, and I already have five. Yeah, so seven herbs aren't enough for me, I don't know. I should have played on easy, if I can select the difficulty. I think I choose normal. Or maybe it has a default difficulty. Okay, this vlog is getting too long. I was talking about Resident Evil. Oh, the name of the final boss is... His name is Norman. If you want to go search how to beat that boss, you can just search in YouTube. Uh, Resident Evil Revelations... Final Boss. Yeah. Or Resident Evil Revelations Jack Norman. Or just Norman. I don't know. Resident Evil Revelations, Norman. Yeah. Spoiler, Parker dies, but not really. He's still alive. Raymond will rescue him. Yay! I don't even know if you can relate to this. Maybe not. I don't know. Oh, look! It's 618! I gotta eat. Yeah, I didn't see that. It's right over there. That's the clock. Yeah, that's the clock. The one that's right above the 3DS. Yeah, I've been playing 3DS for a while. The, the last time I played, the last time I played 3DS was actually yesterday. I played 3DS yesterday. I finished, I finished my Mario 3D Land game. Yeah, this vlog has been eight minutes long already. So I've been talking about video games. So why not make that the title? Oh wait, no. I already have a summer vlog entitled video games or something. Oh, I don't know. Uh, well, yeah, I'm, I gotta go eat dinner. So I'm just gonna edit this later. And. Oh crap. Turn off everything. The window is red! Well, not really. There's a sunset happening right now, or maybe it's over. Okay, anyways, goodbye.